We're going to show you how the Norwegian Armed Forces convert employee feedback into actionable insights. The Norwegian Armed Forces are in a position now where they need to grow in the coming years. And to do so, they need to both be able to find new talent and attract it, but also retain all of the good people that they already have in their organization. And so one of the tools that they've decided to use for this work is the employee survey that they run. Mm -hmm. And you've been helping them build an AI tool that can process those employee survey results and give them actionable insight. So can you tell me more about it and show it to me? Absolutely. This tool here is called uh, AFI. It's a tool that helps you analyze a restricted uh, amount of information, right? In a safe environment. In a safe environment that we need here. So we got a language model here uh, that we have selected is GPT-4. And then we also have something called a system prompt, which is uh, basically a long instruction that tells the AI what to do and how it should process the data, right? And then finally, we have the data. So there are two files. The first one is uh, results from the survey. So that's actually the scores and the responses from the employees. But scores from employees. I mean, I, as an employee, wouldn't want my data to be accessible to an AI tool. So is that intact? Yes. So there are only averages of teams uh, above uh, six people. So we do not expose any personal data from the employees. And we do not expose the organizational structure of the armed forces either to the pro, uh, to the language model. It's only the average scores. So that's very important that Perfect. you ask GDPR about that. GDPR compliant tool. <laughs> exactly. And then we also have, in addition to the data, we have uh, a set of documents that describe how leaders in the armed forces are supposed to act in different situations. And what is happening now is that you get a very compact summary of the results from the survey for that particular team. And you also get advice to the manager about what the manager should, should do given those results. So you can see that uh, the manager should actually work on the psychological safety in the team uh, to make sure that the employees are then feeling uh, safer in a sense in the coming uh, years. And they, it also gives concrete advice about what they should do. I, I really like that this is something that can give you both the quantitative results, but also the qualitative results that you would need as a leader to actually take action to improve teams' well-being, basically. This is the improvement, right? Because many organizations have lots of data, but often the problem is to take the data and bring it into a format that employees and managers can actually use to take action. This makes it easier. Yeah, I, I think this is a great tool and I would very much like you to create something personal for me that I can apply on my kids. That will be uh, my next project. But if you are interested in checking out this tool, then click on the link below.